you know, you've been my idol since like, you know, 2007. I just want to ask, you know, as a player also, how do you maintain this level of competitiveness? You know, we mentioned off of the break that you played with guys who are not playing anymore right yeah. now. But still, right now, you're still being able to keep up this type of level of intensity. So how do you do it, man? I think it's, it's been a blessing in terms of, you know, playing for Rain or Shine in the PBA and, and a program with Coach Kaloy and Coach Yang where minutes weren't always super demanding, you know, how Coach Yang's system is. Everybody gets to play, so your body's pretty fresh. And, you know, personally, I just try to take care of myself. You know, my wife does a great job of, of cooking up some good food to where <laughs> it, it's, not, it's not too weighing down on me. I think I weigh the same exact though weight that I did in 07, but um, I hate you for that. By I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I hate you. I was going to keep that to myself, but I thought I'd throw it out. But, but just all of it, you know, what, what drives me is the same. You know, I like I love to compete. Um, I love to defend and, and challenge myself on that end of the court and, and try to help my teammates as much as I can. What about uh, being there? As you mentioned, you've been there for the highest of the highs and the lowest of the lows. Is that not exhausting? Is that not a tiring experience? to go through that emotional roller coaster year after year? Yeah, mentally. Uh, physically, it's easy. You know, I, I think Jai can attest to it. It's basketball. It's what we love to do. It's, it's what's got us to this point. But uh, mentally, it gets pretty draining, um, even in terms of, you know, coming home and not being able to fully focus on things that you should be focusing on. And uh, I really, like, once again, my wife and my kids have been super patient and supportive through the whole process. And. Uh, yeah, it, it's one of those things where you just have to find ways to, to step away from the game and, and really enjoy yourself and enjoy the, the opportunities that you have. You know, talking about draining, you know, exhausting, everybody sees the success that you guys get, you know, all, all the nice videos, the highlights, and, and the, the fun experiences. But, you know, getting to talk to you guys and your other teammates, it's a, it's a tough process. So talk a, a little bit about how it, uh, what, whatever goes behind the scenes, the practices, right. and how you get to prepare for, for maybe practicing twice a day because of the national team and your PBA team. Yeah, it's definitely demanding. You know, um, you're at the, the international level now to where you, you got to step your game up on every opportunity. And I think this last format was kind of special with the, you know, the, the home and away and playing every three months and things like that. It, it was a mental challenge, it was a physical challenge, and I think the coaching staff did a really good job of trying to get everybody on the same page and kind of press restart every single window. Um, Gabe, how, how special does it feel to be going back to another, personally, another yeah. World Cup for you? Well, hopefully, hopefully I'm part of that 12 that, that makes the, the final roster. For sure you're gonna be part no, of that. But you gotta, that's how you have to approach it. You really do, that's honestly, I, I approach it as if this is my last chance to, to represent the country, and I think, you know, that's the only way you should approach it because if you don't, you're not really enjoying it. You're not accepting the challenge and it is what it is. But um, it's, it's an honor once again to hopefully be in that group that, that gets to represent the country. And, you know, my kids get to see me again. And now my youngest son, who wasn't there for the first World Cup, gets to watch me in this one. So. Uh, I'm excited for the opportunity. What on earth are you saying that you're not yet sure? <laughs> you, you never know. know. Look, you if Coach Ying does not include you <laughs> in the lineup for the World Cup, Jai Reyes will confront you. <laughs> no, I will not. <laughs> unless, unless Jai has my spot, right? Jai might take I, my spot. I, I, I promise you, I promise you, Gabe, if you're not in the lineup, Jai Reyes will, you know, take it up with Coach Ying. All right, I'll leave, it, I'll leave it up to Jai. I, I'm sweating already. <laughs> 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 <laughs>